We are gathered here this evening to witness and bless the marriage of Kylie and Al. Today they bring the fullness of their hearts to share with us and with each other. There is no occasion in life more joyous, but at the same time more important and solemn than entering into a marriage. It is a sacred commitment made in love, kept in faith, and lived in hope. The enduring relationship of husband and wife, which you are about to enter, cannot be undertaken lightly, but only with careful consideration of its duties and consequences. Only on that basis can you establish a happy marriage of two people journeying through life together. Kylie and Al, you are here this evening because you are committed to share your lives together as husband and wife. Because you believe this so sincerely, there are a number of concepts unto which you must embrace. First, remember that a relationship is a progression. It has its own timing and balance, its own, own unique choreography, and its own particular destination. For you, your wedding day today is a beautifully choreographed first step. With it, you are passing through a gateway, which will lead you to many places, including ones which you can't possibly imagine. Wherever it takes you, there will be surprises. Instead of resisting the changes, allow them to flourish in you. And know that they are leading you somewhere, and that separately and together, you're becoming more than you were. Therefore, along with celebrating the wonder of today, remember especially when you're taking your vows that you are promising to hold fast to this love for the long and uncertain future. If you hold fast to this intention, then you can weather the storms with confidence, such as today knowing that stormy skies are temporary and not a reflection of your love as a whole. As I understand it, stormy days and wedding days are, are considered lucky. <laughs> Finally, remember that love is triumphant, for it is love after all and before all that brought you here. Love is the inspiration, the magic, and the healing balm of any marriage. Love is what brought you together Love is what will keep you whole. Love will be the miracle that invites you to learn, to blossom, and to grow. And it is love, to the love you are celebrating on this special day, that you must always return. And so, as you tend to the requirements of your daily, and so as you tend to the requirements of what your daily lives will demand, return in your hearts again and again to the love that you share. Remember, as a married couple, that love will have seasons, that your relationship is a progression, and that love will always prevail. For love is life's highest destiny, its greatest purpose, and its finest work. As it is your intention to enter into marriage, you may now join hands and declare your consent. Al, do you take Kyla to be your wife? We pledge your faithfulness to her in love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness, to live with her and cherish her as long as you both shall live. If so, say, I do. Kylie, do you take Al to be your husband? We pledge your faithfulness to him, in love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness, to live with him and cherish him, as long as you both shall live. Please repeat after me. I, Alfred, take you, Kylie. I, Alfred. To be my wife, and promise before you and these witnesses, 
To love, cherish, respect, and honor you. Caring for you in a lifelong commitment. Always and forever. Till death do us part. Kylie, I, Kylie, take you, Alfred, for all that you are, to be my husband, and promise before you and these witnesses to love, cherish, respect, and honor you. Caring for you in a lifelong commitment, always and forever, till death do us part. The ring is a symbol of the perfection that you should strive for in marriage. It is a perfect circle, having neither a beginning nor an end. It symbolizes endless faith, trust, and everlasting love. May it always remind you both of the solemn vows and obligations which you have assumed today, and always keep you steadfast and faithful. As you now join hands, May you always go hand in hand through life, living and trusting each other. Now you may place the ring on Kylie's finger. Thereby, by the authority vested in me by the laws of the state of Illinois, I now pronounce you to be husband and wife. Now you make this correct. Thank you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Alfred Shaw. Yeah.